the Blood Moon deck. Okay. The exit is this a turn one Chandra or Karn? That's turn one Karn's pretty rough. A Chandra, okay. A Chandra, we can pretend to have a shot against, <laughs> but. Triple Simeon Spirit Guide and eight cards. How much mana is that? Still just two mana, right? Should probably play this, right? Hold on, one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, I got five mana. So that's no good. Next turn, can I play a Nettlesis? Are they going to play like a Chandra minus here? No, okay. Ensnaring Bridge. I do have an Atawar in hand, which is mighty nice. Yeah, I, sh oof, I wonder if I can go for like a one hit kill. I think that's going to have to be my play, right? One, two, three, four, five. Um, I'll still be one short of playing this. Try to stop this from like ultimating. This is Karn. Top deck the old Karn Arena. Of course you top deck Karn. Why wouldn't you top deck Karn? You'd have to file for fucking comp if you didn't top deck a fucking Karn. Holy shit. And you played a land for turn, didn't you? Yeah. Which would be great if they if they top deck another land. So I get to attack Karn if they drew exactly land land. Just draw land for turn. Draw land for turn. Justice. Justice. <laughs> what time? Never justice. Never justice. Or a Chandra maybe. Of course not. Hmm. God, it's so frustrating. Oh, man. Could have won that so fucking easy. <laughs> it had to top deck a card. And they did. That's what the deck does. Let's bring in four Metalker Bukes. And let's cut. Mm. Huh. Cut them. 
Uh, Pith Needle seems fine, I guess. I gotta update the title. Keep this. This is one of those fucking absolutely comically good hands that it's gonna die to like a turn one card. <laughs> it's like, look how this hand's actually just fucking insane. <sighs> Waiting on two matches in the sealed. I'm paying for a Shatter Skull. Hey, buddy. I hate when mono red decks have chrome mox. I don't care when they have simian spirit. This person had double simian spirit guide both openers. Love it. Chalice and zero. And a Trinisphere. That's that's perfectly fine. Don't care about that at all. Mm -hmm. This is crew six. This will only be five apparently. We do have an Atawara, so that's nice. We might be able to do... We can do some damage. We need a Cranial Plating off the top or a Nettle Cyst. Oh, uh, yeah, that should be game. That should be game. Hmm. I'm just going to attack, right? No reason to do anything. Just hold this up. I guess I can crew... F yeah. I can get one extra damage in. Crew six. All right, on the draw, so this is probably a loss. Being on the draw versus this deck is like a death sentence. Yeah, I mean, this is a reasonable hand. We died of Blood Sun. And Trin we don't die of Trinisphere, but we died of Blood Sun. So it's, you know, pick your poison. Pick your poison. I mean, we could try not to die of Blood Sun. Like, obviously, if they play it turn one, we won't run Saga into it, but... They're just shock passing. Hmm. We got dead gone. What is this? First Blood Sun I've seen all match <laughs> to go with the first Saga I've drawn. They're just passing. Okay. So we're at, in a just comically good position. So we'll just... We're just going to hold steady here and try to get a win next turn. Do 
Is like a braid? Oh, punishing fire. They took two to kill that. That as actually, it's like, it's so bad that it, it actually matters. Okay. Ensnaring bridge. Okay. I'm not going to fight over that. They took an extra two damage for that. Okay. Because yeah, we have a thought monitor. I can get a ginger brute here. Yeah, so. That's fine. So I make a token. Okay. Get a ginger brute. How many was one, two, three, four, five mana? It would. But I think what ginger brute means. I can't thought monitor. One, two, three, four. I'd have five artifacts. I have to pay two, including a blue. I think. I gotta think. Gingerbrute attack. I oh, would get a gingerbrute. Yeah, I'm gonna get a gingerbrute. And then we'll just go Highland and tap a gingerbrute. I think just getting in the damage under this. They have two tombs, and they might not be able to get out of from under ensnaring bridge. Punishing fire on ginger brute? Come on. Okay. They didn't tap this. Interesting. All right, so attach with Ornithopter is the way we can win now, which is nice. One, two, three, four. Five artifacts. So I can play Kappa here. One, two, three. Two, three, four, five. No, but then I wouldn't be able to rebuke. And this costs how much? Two. Blue and a colorless. I guess I can play Thought Monitor. Yeah. Thought Monitor can attack if they don't play anything. Pyro. Oh my god, and they have three of it. God, that's so infuriating. They played around Metallic Rebuke, exactly. I have to say okay, right? No, because then I can't rebuke anything else. God, it's so bad. <laughs> <laughs> they didn't pay three they didn't pay three oh my god we have a shot we have a shot oh my god we have a shot now oh my god and we have black black to att attach oh my god oh my god gives me two card types for delirium as well okay that's a little annoying that i don't have this out uh, what do you call it? Ottawa automatically wins as well. So we have a couple of things that instantly, well, the two that win right away. Uh, that's annoying. Oh, and they get back punishing fire now. Oh my god. <sighs> they get back punishing fire the one like the turn literally the turn they have to or they die. I guess I have to play Ornithopter. And cause I have to force them to um, get this back, use this, and if that, will like, capitalize. 
They have two cards in hand. Yeah, they're punishing fire, okay. There's a saga and ginger brute. Which I guess I should have played mean. I should have I could have gotten Oh my god, you're fucking kidding me. I guess I should have held held on to that for one turn. It would have won. Maybe I was yeah, maybe I was supposed to hang on to that ginger brute. Oh, that's decent. I am at six life because I've drawn three ancient tombs. Uh, I think I have to hang on to that. If I draw something that needs it next turn, then I'll play it, but... Okay, cool. God, they actually did draw the Karn, huh? How about that? Ginger Brute, one time. Ginger Brute, one time. Lethal Ginger Brute. My fourth ancient tomb. <laughs> oh my god. Four fucking ancient tombs. <laughs> Alright, finally. Thank god. Alright, so I'm, maybe I can draw something. Right, come on. Come on, Ginger Brute. Ginger Brute. Atawara. Well, hold on. Chalice on one, okay. Oh, man. Oh, they have Punishing Fire, do they? Do they have Punishing Fire? No, they're both in the graveyard. Jingatha won! Jingatha won! <laughs> Jingatha! Oh my god. We're on the draw, but this hand's fucking nutty. Oh yeah, Reinforced Ronin. Cute. So one, two, three, four, five, six. I, I th oh my god, they're not on it. Did they switch to? Oh, are they? Are they just running fetches and burn? Okay, that's fine. All right. Uh, one off of a turn. Damn, that would have been so good. Kappa might be able to race this. Kappa would Dreadnought. If I draw an artifact, then I can Dreadnought them next turn. Hopefully they just play an Eidolon here. No, Reinforced Ronin, sure. Double Reinforced Ronin. Um, I have to take that. Huh. 
Huh. Oh man, what do I want to do here? I can do a bunch of damage, right? Cause I can like one, two, three, four, five. I can play equip a like crew and then equip again. Yeah, I was one off of lethal. That sucks. Did I fuck that up? Oh, I did. I just had to use... I had to use this to crew. Yeah, I actually had to turn two lethal. I used this to crew, equip, and then attack with both of these. And that's, that's a turn two win. Wow, that's cool. Turn two, 20 damage. Sure. Kappa seems crazy slow. Honestly, so do these. Yeah, I messed that up. I actually did have a had more than enough. All right, how much time do we have left in our... There's still 12 people playing, so that's good for us. Um, this hand's not super impressive. No white mana for dispatch. It's a turn... Yeah, we can do better. It's not better. I mean, I, I guess it's not. Yeah, sure. All right, we'll just. We have like an idea of something to do. We get to go double dreadnought into nettle cyst, I guess. They're on three smash to smithereen, so I'm sure that's in their hand. Good start. Well, dispatch is nice. Nice four, nice four power. Three, three mountains in hand. 
Trace of progress. Man, I have to let that happen, huh? Okay. Yeah, that's a pretty good burn hand. Counts to 20 pretty quickly. And you need to like dispatch a turn sooner. Would not have cast these six and seven mana cards. This is one of those hands you need. This hand's pretty nutty. Mm. Go. We take two here. They're not holding a bolt, which is awesome. Should be a turn three win. If they start pointing burn at me, then... I mean, they need smash on cranial plating, so... Nope, no smash on cranial plating. Wow. <laughs> that was really impressive, games one and three. That did a lot of fucking damage quickly. I respect burn players, though. Too many lands, but if I mold and just didn't have a seed, I would keep it, so. Yeah, if that seat was like a Mox Opal, then Seat of the Synod or something. Lands? Fucking lands? If I, they obviously have a fucking crop rot, right? Oh my god, I don't have Pithy Needle on the main deck. God, that's kind of shitty of me. God, I should I don't know why I took it out. I guess I can make them create one to block this. Yeah. 
Yeah, I have to make a mega 2020 to block this and then not to wire it. That's the only way to stay alive. Oh my god, a crop rotation. Oh no, not a crop rotation. Who would have ever thought crop rotation was coming? I did not know that there was this combination of cards that had synergy like this. All right, we go to 23. Still in a pretty bad spot, oh my God. Dead to a lot now. Yeah, needed that needle main deck. Needle main deck would have won. I can't believe they didn't make it in response. That was such a loose play. Like if I had just built my deck well. Uh, so they have punishing fire and I lose. Can't play around it, right? Like. Yeah, like you have it. Don't just just do it. Don't slow roll it. Jesus Christ. <laughs> like fucking come on. Who are you kidding? Like you're not going to cast that. Uh Ley lines. Mm. I brought in dispatches before take care of the 2020. God, that's such a, that was such a frustrating fucking loss. That was such a fucking frustrating loss. <laughs> In the sealed thing. <laughs> oh my god, that's so bad. I have to keep because it has ley lines and it has a way to kill fucking... A dumbass fucking 2020. So I'm like, go. Saga. Yeah, he's okay. Uh, that's pretty irritating. Love a card with text. Yeah, I mean it. It lets me get it on the board. Do we have Force of Vigor, Green Card, and Loam? Probably. Probably. I just crop out for Saga. It's also pretty annoying. For a Taiga? They just crop out for a Taiga? It's silly, but like you have to attack, I guess, because if they want to do like crop rot for Yavamaya. Punishing fire, okay. I'm happy to get rid of that punishing fire. So. 
That's fine. Oh, yeah, we just want to hard cast a Vigor, it looks like. Hard cast the old Vigor, huh? No. Interesting. Uh, if they go for a 2020 and we get to dispatch it, oh my god, it'd be so fucking great. Oh my god, dispatch is such an MVP of a card. Should be game. Do I pith? I think I pith and needle maze, and this might be lethal. Is there not pith and needle in my deck? Did I not put it in the sideboard? There is, and I didn't bring it in? Oh my god, what, what the fuck am I even doing here? I guess you get a... A ginger brute? And Ginger Brute with the Cranial Plating, I mean, uh, Cannonist with the, Cannoneer with the Cranial Plating should be good enough. Alright, cool. Yeah, I should get, put this Pit Needle in. <laughs> I don't know what the fuck I was thinking. I'm Soul Guide, maybe for some Middle Sis. Cool, cool, cool. God, I'm so mad about sealed. Oh, I was one game away from locking up my fucking token. <laughs> and then they slow roll it to us. <laughs> oh my god. And the fact that they had Sanctifier on turn like turn three or four both games just insult to injury. Only have like Lens Flare to deal with that. Sand's not great, but I'll, you know, it has a ley line and it has the dispatch, so. I'll fuck with it. We got a name here, Wasteland, still. Nah, Urza's Saga, maybe? 
I haven't seen one yet. I feel like they would have crop routed for one. Despian stage, just keep the combo off. Let's go with that for now. Probably just gonna have bigger than both anyway, and it doesn't matter. Yeah, exactly. Opponent knows what's up. I hope, yeah, I was gonna say, maybe they kept like a little slightly weak hand. Fuck off with these draws. Oh man, that's so frustrating. <laughs> You're like, give me anything relevant. How about a second Mox Opal? That sounds, that's basically what you want. Oh, I almost named fucking Saga, but I hadn't seen one all game. <sighs> well, it didn't matter if I named the right thing or whatever, so. There's a Thespian stage, I guess. This is going to be a pain in my ass to try to win. Especially if they have a loam, which I suspect they do. Needle and plating. Fuck off, dude. Oh my god, I brick on land. They draw another wasteland. Sure. And have mox diamond. Because why not? Oh, uh, my match started. Go Rift Sower. God. Rift Sower is just so fucking good. Guys, it's a very frustrating way to lose. <laughs> it's just the they who drew more saga. This opponent, I didn't mean to slow like be a dick. Sorry, you got me. Yeah, I drew my saga. <laughs> Ten turns too late. So. See if I can get a four-one with this garbage deck, and then go to sleep. Sure. Holy fuck, this deck is so garbage. Can we ban bubbles already? What the fuck? Ban fucking bubbles already. And of course they hit an Aether Spell Bomb. <laughs> Just like, why wouldn't they hit Aether Spell Bomb? Chalice on zero. That definitely helps me more than it helps them. Now they have Emery Thought Monitor. Really cool. <laughs> of course I draw zero immediately after I say that. Ah. Uh. One, two, three. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. There's no way for me to attack with consulate this turn, right? I'm 
know they're going to replay Ether Spell Bomb. One, two, three, four artifacts, five artifacts. This will cost two. I need to tomb create. That'll be four power, five power total. That's no good. I'll have four artifacts in play. This will cost three. I, I'm just making sure I'm not like, I'm like it's maybe a stupid to some people, but I'm making sure I, I can't crew. I'm thinking I'm just one off no matter how I do it. So I play a seat and get an artifact, and then if I crew Memnite to make the artifact, it's only five. And if I do Ancient Tomb and do that, that's four power, five power, and I have yeah, four artifacts, so this would cost three, and I can only make one, so no matter what. So. Because it's no matter what, I should just play seat then to reduce the amount of damage I'm taking. Yeah, dude. I mean, do it. I think this, this is just going to be who... They're attacking? Do they have another thought monitor? Really? I guess they're just gonna bounce my token. Bounce my token right now, probably. I guess. Sure. Sure. <laughs> I draw zero zero. <laughs> oh my god. Sure. So one, two, three, four, five, six. Uh, do I do Ginger Brute, Shadow Spear? I think Shadow Spear because this might try to block. That costs one. But I think I... <sighs> I think I want to just equip onto this. They didn't even play either spell bomb. That's funny. Okay. They're forcing. That's good. Um, so I just equip on my token, I guess. They're not running borrower main, so... Okay. 
Targeting thought monitor. One, two, three, four. They have Saga. All right, so this should be lethal. All right, just, they're just dead on board. They're literally just dead on board. Yep. Cool, cool, cool. Nice chalice on zero. Um, well, we want needle and probably dispatches. Ornithopters are pretty weak. Put some of the things that could get needled. Yeah, let's trim like the needle needle stuff. I guess the ornithopter won't get needled. It helps us be a little quicker. They made chalice. They chalice on zero, which was wrong, but maybe they learned. Oh, let's try that. God, I'm so fucking tilted about sealed. Mm, sounds pretty bad. <laughs> it's like one off of everything in every direction. Sounds much better. Shadow Spear, I guess. It's Shadow Spear. We could just look it up with the saga, right? So. Metal Cysts. They had the first saga, so let's see if that indicates who wins. Are they really going to pop a pedal to make a token? There's my Urza Saga token. <laughs> okay, and now you can't make a second one. Now are you gonna needle Saga? That would be pretty annoying, not gonna lie. Considering I have a second Saga. You have the Needle Saga, right? I got Opal with two artifacts. Okay. Oh, you have Needle in hand. Okay, yeah. That's obviously a Needle in hand. <laughs> what else could you ever have? Double Needle. Are you going to name Ginger Brute? Oh, I named Ginger Brute. Yes. All right. Now we get to slam a Kappa. Imagine playing Bubbles when you could play Salamanders. Okay, you got me. That's all I'm saying. Wow.
go right back up to 18. How do we feel about that? Cool. GG. And let's finish out the league and see if we can get a nice 4 1. <laughs> Alright, so we can get a 4 1. Come on, opponent. There's a little prediction if anyone likes to gamble. All right, let's rip a quick 4 1. Ali, no, not lands. Not lands. Fuck. God damn it. I'm going to keep this. Uh, get rid of Sojourner. And. This. 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 That has to be. I just need him not to have a wasteland on turn one, but come on. Go. Taiga, Crop Rot Wasteland, or Exploration Wasteland. Mm hmm. Oh, come on, we all know what's going to happen. Yep. Sure. Why not? Oh, Tabernacle. Even worse or better, I guess. Ancient Tomb off the top? No, of course not. Like that would be like the the thing that actually punishes them. <laughs> Damn, that would have been nice. 
sure and long. We can just concede because lands players never don't have it. <laughs> sure. We could roll the six. Roll the six. Solid. I'll bring in some ley lines. With damn, my only two losses are gonna be the lands. That's frustrating. This dude is really hard to cast. Okay, let's try that. Give Ali some free points. Oh, I just, no, I didn't, okay. Okay, let's just die to Ali. We can be done with this fucking shit show. Yeah, what can I put? I thought of putting Ankh of Mishra in the deck, in the sideboard, but like, I think it's Force of Vigor just hits anything you have versus them, right? Like, it doesn't matter at all. So, it's kind of moot. That's fine. I guess I should have attacked those. I missed one damage. I'm sure, it's about to get force of vigor. Or punishing fired, huh? Hmm. He actually made a mistake there, which is pretty nice. If I attacked first, then uh, 
I couldn't have made mana to eat it, so. S small mistake, I doubt it'll cost me. Wasteland, huh? And not wasting? Hmm. Interesting approach. Three cards in hand. Playing Ottawar as a land drop. Just as the crop rot. Maybe it's crop rot, uh, like force of vigor, green card, then. Okay. It's going to be a crop rot, force of vigor, green card, isn't it? Last card is 100% of fucking crap, right, isn't it? 